being versed in the blue corner. Official weight, 108 pounds. He has a record of eight wins, six losses with three draws. Please welcome Junue Lacar. And across the ring is his opponent in the red corner. Official weight, 109 pounds. With a record of nine wins with one defeat from one above sports management. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing Mark Barriga. And here we go, Bati number 9. This is Mark Anthony Barriga, the baby boy against Junuel Lacar. Mark Anthony Barriga po yung uh, nakasuot po ng uh, green and black gloves. At uh, itong si Lacar, naka red and white with blue gloves. And he is attacking early. Mark Anthony Barriga testing itong si Mark Anthony Barriga who has been... Uh, uh, no, sidelined since 2018 his last fight was against Carlos Licona at the Staples Center where he tried uh, and bid for the IBF world minimum weight title he failed that one uh, he lost via split decision but that was a good fight so this is his comeback and Jewel Lacar is welcoming him back in the boxing world at uh, he's attacking right now wild shot uh, Junuel Lacar <coughs> Uh, Mark Anthony Bariga, just uh, to remind everyone, uh, has uh, nine wins, one loss, and uh, one knockout no, 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 in his record. Break, break, break. Uh, and uh, no, his no, opponent, no. see Junuel Lahar, eight wins, six losses, three draws, with six knockouts. And uh, Junuel looking to uh, give a good welcome to Mark Anthony Bariga, who's well known for his boxing skill. As uh, he's an Olympian, uh, a lot of people call him Little Floyd. Because, oh, but he got hit no, right no, there no, no, no. with the attacks break, 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 of Junuel Lahar. Good job early for Junuel Lahar attacking. As he knows, na he needs to attack and break down that defense. Pero it's gonna take a while because uh, this guy, the baby boy, he no, holding, no, holding. is really good in his uh, footwork and his movement and, of course, his defense. And let's see if he still got that. And he's attacking now. <laughs> Juno Lacar is actually uh, two inch longer. Mark Anthony Bariga showing some fight right there. Good jab, good follow up with the straight southpaw position. Juno Lacar though, who is roughing it up? You can see the size difference there when they clinched. This is uh, happening uh, at the IPI compound uh, brought to you by Omega Sports Promotions. Uh, this is in Mandawi City, Cebu, the Philippines. <laughs> Mark Anthony Bariga, good counter, good attack, however, as well for Junuel Lacar. Junuel Lacar is doing what he needs to do. As same as uh, Mark Anthony Bariga, who's the been doing some countering 26 seconds attacking once again is Junwell Lakar good exchange Mark Last 10 seconds. is uh, inching closer let's see if he attacks right here And he exchanged late in this round, and uh, Junwell Lahar ended with a body shot that ends the first round. Please observe video without protocols, like wearing a face mask and face Let's look at the replay right here. physical distancing of six feet from one another. 
Mark with the counter, three punch, counter punch. Nice work. Two of the has been aggressive. Let's see if we can continue to do that. For a guy that has been out since 2018, I think uh, Mark Anthony Burgi is doing okay. He's 27 years old and he's still got a lot of fight in him. Let's see if he can show that in the second round against Junwe Lakar, who has been really aggressive. You know, I I went to Junwe Lakar's camp in M at MP Malabon in Metro Manila, and he said that uh, he's confident that. Uh, he can give a good fight. His team was actually really confident as well. And let's see. He got a warning right there. Punching at the back of the head. By the way, our referee is uh, Romor. Imbodo. Good counter. And I think that's the key here for uh, Junwe Lakar. For, I mean, uh, Mark Anthony Bariga. We can expect Junwe Lakar to just keep on moving forward. And uh, attacking... Uh, the defensive-minded Mark Anthony Bariga, and he needs to make sure that uh, Junwell Lahart thinks twice before he attacks. And uh, although break, break, break. No, you know no, we've no, seen no. some slipping and sliding in good defense for Mark Mark Anthony Bariga, I think he needs to return with with a counter punch so that uh, Lahart could uh, respect him as he attacks. Maybe Lahart seen the the knockout ratio, but you know it doesn't really mean. Uh, that he is not uh, a heavy handed as well. Uh, let's see. You know, accumulation of punch, maybe it would not put you down, but it could still hurt you. And Juno Lakar and Mark Anthony Bariga, I'm sure, knows that. Mark Anthony Bariga now trying to attack himself. You can see the movement of uh, Bariga here. Uh, he's trying to lure in uh, Junwe Lakar and he's gonna unleash probably that uh, left straight. Good movement! Wow! You know, um, Mark Anthony Bariga also likes basketball. And uh, one of his uh, idols in basketball is the one they call Terrence Romeo, who's very good in his footwork and his crossover. And uh, I just saw a glimpse of that move right there. Second round. Six rounds fight. Another warning from the referee. Sa mga nanonood po, if you're watching this right now and if you're still not subscribed to Powercast Sports, please do so. We love Filipino boxing. And uh, please continue to support Filipino boxing and, uh, you know, so you don't miss any updates, my commentary and all my other videos. Please hit that notification bell as well. Good combination there, Mark Anthony Bariga. Fast one. Junwe Lakar trying to move inside here. One, two combination again. Very good job. No Junwe Lakar. Break, break, break. Retaliating. No holding, no holding, no holding. Break, 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 break. Mark was trying to tell something, Oops. say something to the ref, I guess. There you go, roughing it up. <laughs> That's the end of that round. What do you think so far? Replay action brought to you by Mega Pink Killer. There you go with the counter. What a nice counter. And uh, Mark Anthony Bariga has been trying to set that up. And this fight has 
you can see in the, the footwork is the hesitating uh, stepping backward but uh, his left hand is uh, really loaded locked and loaded to counter and that was a good example of that Alright, Dumpati number 9 brought to you by Omega Sports Promotion. My name is Pao Salud. Welcome once again. This is round number 3. <clears throat> Lakar attacking again as he is supposed to do. That's the key. Ooh, though, that counter, that straight hand has been uh, there for Mark Anthony Bariga and uh, Junwell Lakar need to learn how to keep his hands up. Break, 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 break. And uh, <laughs> nice move right there, though. I, I would agree a little bit that uh, Junuel Lahar needs to a, a bit of roughing here. He's big, he's bigger, and uh, he needs to know who's the the boss. Like uh, he needs to push around. I I I remember the strategy of. Uh, Jeff Horn against Manny Pacquiao. Horn was bigger, so he was roughing him up. And uh, break, break. No punch, although no I still believe that Pacquiao won that fight, but uh, we... Pacquiao lost officially, though. And here we go, exactly what we're talking about. But Mark Anthony Bariga just uh, pushed him, as if to say, "No, you can't bully me." Yeah, the straight once again. Entertaining third round. There you go, look at this. He knows that um, Junwen Lakar is gonna attack. And just just look at the feet. The step back. He, that immediate counter, that's really uh, the signature of this uh, guy. And of course, this uh, defense. Shoulder roll defense. AKA a la Floyd Mayweather. That's great. No, 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 no. Another body shot unloaded as they separate in a clinch. Mark no, 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 no. exchanging here as he acknowledges the action again that Juno you know, Lafar is bringing. There you go, right hand again. And the one to a pass hands. Junwe, Shanamana, Bumana. Good combination. Mark Anthony Bariga is not stepping backward. He is looking to exchange right now. Let's see what he does here with his hands up. 30 seconds. Okay. Box. But he got looking to attack. Wow. Going to the head and the body hit there. They're exchanging now. A little no, bit of no, changes no, in complexion no, because the shoulder, shoulder. earlier it ah, was. Oops. Warning, ah, shoulder, ah. warning from the referee. Let's look at the replay once again. Sometimes I cannot see the, the quick responses of Mark Anthony Bariga. There you go, good left straight. It's not that solid, but still, it could be a, a scoring punch. Oy, left hand. But the other punches is slipped. And, that, and, that. and uh, I need to ask all the fans that are watching this right now. Um, we're going, gonna go to round number four. What do you think so far? Ano na kita niyo kay Mark Anthony Bariga? Should yeah, is he ready for another world title shot or a few more fights? Uh, what do you think? I mean, uh, 
Is he ready to fight uh, abroad? What do you think, guys? Still the same? Somehow different? Yeah, here's what I think. I think Mark Anthony Badiga uh, is looking good here in his ring return after uh, two, since 2018. Junwell Lakar, however, trying to give him a good fight right here. And Junwell Lakar uh, was doing really good and attacking and roughing it up. And Mark Anthony Bariga, however, started to move forward too. A good right hook. You know, regardless of what people say, and uh, you know, I've asked people, Mark Anthony Bariga, they say that that doesn't have power. But uh, imagine getting hit by those punches. You know, uh, getting hit with the counter. That's re getting hit with with small punches. Okay. Uh, it, it's it's no, hard. It's no, the, no, demoralizing no, to you, and uh, you know sometimes you, you you get hurt by accumulation of punches. I, I remember Pacquiao. They're saying he's not a hard puncher, but uh, the punch that's no, coming no, from break, 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 break. from the, break, break, break. a direction that you can't see, and it's a lot of punches that will hurt you. And Mark Anthony Bariga right now unloading here, trying to show his offensive wares against Junuel Lahar. No, no, One, no, two no, punch, no, punch break, to break, the break. back. Books. <clears throat> Good straight. Break, break, break. Oops, oops. Hey. Books. I like it here a little bit because Mark Anthony Bariga no, 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 is uh, obliging no, the no, 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 the boxing here. Box. Although the referee needs to control a little bit. Some roughing uh, up here. Round number four. Why some bag? Why some bag, Leo? Break, 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 break. Okay. They clinch again. One, two, three punch to the body. That time from coming from Mark Anthony. There you go, Mark Anthony. You see when he hesitates on his feet, he's gonna allow the right straight or a left straight counter. Holding, holding. Or a right hook. There you go, the straight. The problem with that is uh, if you're attacking, uh, and you know, we always say keep your hands up, but that hand, that right hand is up, so there's no other hand to defend your face because that hand, uh, the hand has been unloaded and the body shot going to the body for Mark Anthony. Mark Anthony Bariga loading some combination right there and another one. No holding, no holding, no holding, no holding, no holding. It is, no this holding. is becoming an action pack break, fight. Break, 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 no holding, hey, hey, box. One, two. June will apart with his own combination. Last 10 seconds. And the exchange in the middle of the ring. Trying to catch Mark Anthony Bariga in that end the, the round, end of the round. Let's look at the replay right here. What we can't see, there you go. Good slipping and sliding defense, head movement. And although he got caught with the last right hook. Roughing up. Bariga exchanging here. Galing, galing. I like it because Mark Anthony Bariga is exchanging. So he's showing us uh, that he is uh, ready to fight. And uh, Junwell Lakar just spit his mouth in peace. Looking at his ref. Looks like he's uh, a little bit tired right here. Oh, my yo. Uh oh. Jun Willakar exiting the ring. And uh, looks like he doesn't want to continue. And uh, what do you know? Mark Anthony Bariga will list uh, a TKO win and he improves 
not only his win record but his knockout record too not just one but two so far Anthony Barika now improves to 10 wins and one loss here's the official Ladies announcement and gentlemen, the round number four the fighter from the blue corner refuses to continue we have a winner by TKO victory, ladies and gentlemen, Mark Barriga! And the baby boy is back again. Let's look at the uh, some of the actions of the fight. There you go, the quick hands counter. Mark Anthony Barriga did what he needed to do with those counter punching attack and those defense. And, uh, you know, I'm still not quite sure why uh, Junwe Lahar uh, suddenly didn't want to continue. He was also doing good. Uh, but who knows, right? We'll find out soon as uh, Junwe Lahar exchanges, exchanges blows here from uh, with Anthony Bariga. But Anthony Bariga was just there and willing and he won. 